um, so to start MapReduce development program, uh, we have to set up our development environment on our PC. So there is a easy way to start development that is to use our Cloudera VM. Uh, it comes with Eclipse as well. You can start it and it have Maven plugin and you can start the development. But to simulate traditional uh, project development lifecycle, we will not typically develop on our servers. So leave the Cloudera VM uh, like a QA server or a production server and try to set up development environment on your uh, PC. So in this case on my Mac. Okay. So to start with, uh, you need to have uh, some IDE. Any IDE with Eclipse flavor is good. But I am using Spring Tool Suite. You can search for it and uh, you can choose uh, uh, this spring tools suite and you can download it it comes with uh, too many good features so many good features and um, uh, i have downloaded it for my mac and i have opened it up and it will look like this okay and it comes with uh, maven plugin as well so uh, you will understand the significance of maven uh, just in a moment uh, uh, but let me uh, try to create a new project go to file click on new and uh, then uh, uh, select maven project so this is the one which you need to choose and if you are not using the spring tool suite i think you have to click on project and in that you will see the maven project in the list but as i am using spring tool suite uh, it is available as part of new and you can click on it directly Okay, now it will ask you for a uh, uh, for uh, some details. You can uh, change the default location. I don't want to use uh, uh, the uh, default location. What it is saying, so I am changing it. In in our case, we are developing for cards, so I am creating a default location as cards or um, location for cards for this uh, project click on next you can choose the default archetype i am not getting into details uh, about what the archetype is and you can define group id let me define group id as uh, lab and artifact id is as cards okay and package name will be uh, by default it it, uh, it automatically uh, declared the name as lab.cards i am fine with that I am uh, doing finish. I am clicking on finish, and uh, once the project is created, as we have used the default archetype, you will see a, a directory layout. So this is the feature of Maven. Maven uh, 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 archetypes are similar to wizards, and depending upon the archetype you choose, it will create the directory structure. I have used the default one, and it has created this directory structure. And if you expand source main Java, uh, whatever package name it is, uh, it is uh, uh, decided when we uh, gave uh, um, artifact ID and group ID, a package will be created and there will be a file called app.java in that. So here uh, you can see the app.java file and uh, then you can uh, look at pom.xml. So pom.xml uh, will have uh, 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 is to facilitate you to download all the dependencies for your project for your project uh, uh, and we will see how it can be leveraged in the next uh, in the next session uh, to uh, when we are designing the pom.xml okay to to validate our project is working you can right click on app.java and you can click on uh, run as and you can select java application and it will run the program and it will give the output and if you look at the app.java code it is just a system.outprintln hello world and in, it printed out hello world so uh, that's it i hope you enjoy this session uh, we need to have eclipse with maven plugin and i have decided with uh, spring tool suite and i have downloaded it and installed it and we will use uh, this for our development uh, and then uh, our cloud as a vm uh, uh, to as a 
simulating a QA box or production box to validate or to run our programs and see the results. That's it for this session. Thank you.